I am an impact-driven eco-feminist in the climate change and environment protection sector. My role is to prove on the local, national, international level that the youth inclusion should go beyond advocacy and conference participation. The issue of loss and damage, usually referred as climate change induced impact, is important to me because it affects my country's ability to achieve a sustainable economic development. It affects uh, women, especially uh, those located in the rural area. It is the only tangible approach where youth can participate in climate action while pursuing an economic development. And also it is the one of the one of the area where we it is visible the climate the inequality of climate finance accessibility especially for vulnerable communities i had a story and an experience to share so i grabbed the first opportunity to get my story out this was through writing a blog this was when i id published a call of authors for least developed country. I didn't think twice to share my story, despite that English is my third language, and also uh, in, um, in getting access to the right tools or right uh, messages to incorporate in my blog. I hope that uh, my animation will reach, first of all, my community, especially uh, primary students. And also I wish that my animation will inspire youth across the continent in every sector to share their experience. But most importantly, I want this to be a proof for leaders that youth inclusion can and should be beyond advocacy. I want people to have hope and to address climate action with a sense of urgency after seeing my blog. On a particular uh, note, I want this message. Uh, my mission went to reach vulnerable community to give them a sense that we are in this together and no one is left behind.